It has been a huge day here in the mountains. We were there to see Team USA pick up that very first gold medal and to see Sean White prove that even after two decades in the Olympics, guys, he's still there to show up and absolutely crush it when it matters. A gold medal for Team USA. Lindsay Jacob Ellis nabbing the U.S. its first gold of the games in snowboard cross. Redemption after an early celebration cost her the gold in 2006. Now in her fifth Olympics at 36, she's the oldest snowboarder to ever win an Olympic medal. And a nail biter on the half pipe. Sean White in his fifth and what he said will be his final Olympics, wiping out in his first run while trying to pull off his signature move, the double McTwist 1260. Sitting in 19th place near the bottom of the pack in the qualifying round with only one more run to go. The three-time gold medal winner needing to crack the top 12 to keep his medal dreams alive. With it all on the line, the 35-year-old, the oldest competitor in the event, smashing his second run, jumping to a fourth place finish. His teammates Chase Josie and Taylor Gold joining him in the finals. And a promising start for Chloe Kim. Nailing her qualifying round, hoping to defend her gold from 2018, soaring past the competition in her first run. Even an unexpected fall in her second, not enough to knock her off the top of the leaderboard going into the finals. But it was heartbreak on the slopes for ski legend Michaela Schifrin, the 26-year-old striking out in her best event, the slalom, just two days after a fall in the giant slalom cost her a chance at a medal. Schifrin lasting a mere five seconds out of the gates, leaving her absolutely devastated on the mountain. But a huge win in one of the Olympics' new events. Utah's Colby Stevenson taking big risks in big air. After a rough landing in round one, he went on to land a switch double cork 1800, walking away with a silver medal. And with Lindsay Jacob Ellis's victory, Team USA put its first gold medal on the board, putting it at 10th place in the gold medal race. Germany's in the lead with five. But guys, we have a few big events coming up in the next couple of days, so Team USA could be climbing up that leaderboard soon. Michael? Well, well, we'll definitely be watching that, Maggie. And the U.S. skating team, they were supposed to get their silver, me silver medals last night, but the ceremony was delayed. What happened? Yeah, Michael, exactly. I remember earlier this week, the Russian Olympic Committee won gold in the team figure skating event, just edging out Team USA, who got that silver medal. And the medal ceremony was supposed to take place last night, but then it was suddenly postponed when the IOC was asked why. Uh, they just said that it was a legal matter that came about suddenly. But guys, we still don't know exactly what that legal matter is all about. Guys? A little mysterious there. <laughs> Thank you so much, Maggie. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.